So we're doing some driver introductions today. So we are down here with... I thought you were going to say my name. I'm going to say it wrong, so I'm going to let you say it. I'm Kelly Shryock from Fertile, Iowa. Okay, and you're the driver of the number three. Number three. And uh, how long have you been in collaborations with B&B Racing Chassis? And I, kind of tell us your backstory. I think probably the last three or so years, um, a buddy of mine, Pete Alexander, thought it'd be cool. He asked if I want to drive a stock car at Brit. I think it was three years ago, maybe four now. I was like, hell yeah, I want to drive one of them things. And, <laughs> and we did pretty good. And then uh, um, Mike, uh, Lake Mills Motorsports, Mike Howen thought maybe, we, you know, he owned some modifieds and he thought maybe we should get a stock car. So, um, hooked up with uh, Paul, BB Chassis, and uh, kind of been a really good relationship we have with him. We get cars from Paul and uh, do our little skyrocket tricks to him, and uh, uh, so far it's been pretty successful for us. Okay, and this week uh, at Super Nationals, um, you are kind of one of the su success stories. So take us through the first few days, how everything went down uh, with your modified, with your stock car, and well, it's been pretty good. I mean, to, to get both cars in on first day has been really a dream come true for anybody that races Boone. We've been here, run every race possible, and still not make the show. But um, you know, stock car we drew a little worse. Our first heat race um, started uh, fifth, got second. Then redrew the 24 and got fourth. So we're in the big show, but we're going to be starting pretty deep. So we're going to need a little luck to get through that if we can and uh, see if we can get the stock car into uh, the victory lane. Modified was pretty good. We drew the pole of our heat and won our heat and then uh, redrew a three and ran second in the qualifying feature. So we're in that show. So again, um, you know, we all come here to stand on that stage on the infield there and we're pretty lucky to be able to do it with the with the stock car so hopefully we can get back up on that big stage and uh um come out of boom with some with some more memories for us yep and last night you ran the inaugural uh b, &B racing chassis stock car all-star race yes um where'd you start there to walk us through it tell us how it went we started eight um you know we were reaching that bucket there was possibly of 30 numbers and you know you don't want to start 30 and then we got a decent draw of eight and kind of missed the first lap mangle there a little bit and you know generally we can I like running where the groove is and for me the middle of the bottom works pretty good because we can kind of pin it up there and the top's always fast so the top side they were kind of getting away from me there a little bit it's like just be patient Top's gonna slow down a little. The bottom was still a little bit greasy. It's like just be patient. Don't burn your tires up. And then pretty soon, the top started slowing down, and the bottom got not quite so greasy. And, and that was pretty good at the end there. And you came out on the stage. Got to put the car up on that stage, and yeah. So being a part of the B and B clan, you know, Paul's a super good guy to work with. His cars are really good. He, he, he's all in on racing. He has a heart about his race cars going fast, and it reminds me a lot of my business, and we enjoy working with Paul, so hopefully we can keep this relationship up. All right. Well, thank you very much for taking the time out, and good luck on Saturday, and hope we'll see you back on that big stage. That would be pretty cool. Thank you. All right, thanks.